Hi guys, I'm Lay and welcome back to Lay's Life. And if you want to see how I achieved this look and how I feel about um, Judy's Place and Foundation and their eyeshadows in general, I did all of this, well not all of this, but majority of this with their products. So if you want to see how they go, stay tuned.
I was so excited about doing the glitter lips last week that I forgot to mention that this week, or today actually, we're going to be reviewing not only Julia's Place palettes in which I just did this eye with, but Julia's Place foundation, okay? Big dreams, big hopes for this because I have been watching every YouTube review that I could find on these foundations. All different skin types. Everybody had different, not skin types, um, skin colors. To know if it didn't, if it wasn't just good for one skin tone. Because we get that a lot with makeup. And they're just finally starting to the point where we got to an avenue where we are doing makeup to suit like African American women, which is great. I'm, I'm ecstatic. Okay, all right. I'm excited. Burkina. This is three ten. So I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all what's going on there. All right. So then I went and got Nairobi four ten. I felt like we got a little bit, a little bit closer. So I was like, we're going to do that. We're going to try that. I don't know what this is going to be like, guys. Um, by the way, I brought you to the bathroom for this because I wanted us to get, we'll try to get the best lighting we could. And there's no mystery that I'm still getting the lighting thing down in my apartment. So here we are. I'm just watching. Process and we're gonna see how it wears through the rest of this process. So, I'm gonna do like we would do with our regular foundation. Oh, okay. So, here I gotta give y'all a little story about the um, concealer. I saw that they were selling the foundation in Ulta, and when I got there. They told me that they are selling the foundation, but not the concealer. Which I thought it was both. Once again, my fault, not their fault. So I was I was genuinely disappointed. I was genuinely disappointed. I really was. Because I truthfully wanted to purchase them both right then and there. So I don't know how much control they had over that. But in the future, Juvia's Place, 
I would really like to be able to purchase the concealer in a store. So there's a little story coming. But what I'm going to do is when I do get it, I'm going to let y'all know how it is because I heard great things about it. And I'm standing pretty, pretty firm with Standing pretty firm with um, part and shape tape, and I just don't feel some some concealer is gonna come in between our relationship. I really don't. But y'all know I'm, I'm down to try. You know I'm down to try. So we're gonna see. We're gonna see. But so far, and also I heard that it they complemented each other very well. But. So far, with the sh with the shape tape, I'm not I'm not disappointed. boxycharm from last month have made it into the mix today so i'm gonna throw some of that in there too why not it's quite cool all right so this um blush palette i like it i like it a lot um i know a lot of people were complaining excuse all the back of my hands a lot of people were complaining about the colors that they got but i actually got the perfect colors and i like it oh jesus and then I got, which I'm going to show you guys in a second. Um, and it's nasty now because I just put my little nasty hands on it. Um, the Steve Laurent um, lip is posh. It's a lip gloss. I, I actually, we're going to show you since I got a handful of um, makeup anyway. Like, how pretty. How pretty is that? How pretty is that? There we go. So, and I also got mm -hmm, a lip pencil from Vintage. This pencil is so creamy, guys. You know I love creamy products. You know I don't know what to do. The moment I get a creamy product, especially a lip liner, keep sending me creamy lip liners. I'm just going to die of happiness. So, there's that. place theme I'm going to be using one of their colors from one of their pants as a highlight and it's gonna be the color that I have in 
this part because I'm feeling crazy. Why not? I got two different types of clothes on. That's cute. Why not? So you can bring a brush in here for this type of stuff. It smells so good, oh my God. together we've made this look and I will be back and we will we will discuss things okay so here is how I feel after um first of all I mean they did their thing I don't think that I can say that they didn't do that they did their thing um the, it doesn't feel heavy I don't feel like I have on full coverage foundation at all, which when you have on full coverage foundation, you can feel it. And I don't, it doesn't feel like that. My pores don't feel like overwhelmed. Like it doesn't feel like that. Um, I like it. I do. Is it going to replace my makeup forever? No, but they will be friends in this household. And we're going to put them together. I'm going to use them interchangeably. And we're going to see. We're going to put them through some real tests because I think that they are neck and neck right now. I haven't decided to just leave makeup for every y'all know I love them. Okay. So, what was I about to say? Oh, yeah. Um, the looks that were done with the Juvia's Place palettes. I own, like, probably like five or six their palettes. I love them. I also really like bright colors and craziness and the last thing you would think to do to your face makeup wise I I'm probably down so I don't I like I like crazy colors I like boldness they do have more chill palettes but I love the fact that they came up with such beautiful colorful palettes for everyone and more so for women of color because we didn't we couldn't that wasn't happening that wasn't happening so this is dope but I love it I'm excited about it 
I'm waiting for the concealer to come in so that I can really like put them neck and neck because right now I have on my Tarte uh, shape tape and I don't think that it's going to knock my baby out the, out the line. I think that this is going to continue to be their face. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but thank you guys so much for tuning in. Come back again. Subscribe and hit the bell if you want to be notified. Thank you. Bye.